Hi guys, this is Shuman from ASA Technical. Today I am going to show you how to fix PC run into a problem and needs to restart. We are collecting error info and then we will restart for you. Earlier we have made a video on this issue. But many users say that they got some difficulties while fixing this error issue. So especially this video is for those people who face some difficulties during fixing this error. Well, at first let's start with the easy method. It is little bit time consuming method but it's 100% works. Alright, in order to fix this issue, at first you will need to turn on your computer. Although, turning on your computer is pretty difficult in this situation. But don't worry, just follow me to turn on your computer. Just restart your computer and be ready to press and hold down the escape plus F1 button and simultaneously continue hit on spacebar until the user visuals to appear. Try this, I am 100% sure it will definitely work. You are done, as you can see. Note, after turning on your computer, do not restart again until your problem is fixed. Alright, now you will need to download Windows 10 ISO according to edition and version of your Windows. Note, edition and version must be the same. I have already downloaded from Microsoft according to edition and version of my Windows 10. So I am not downloading it again. If you don't have a Windows installation media, then here's a certain tutorial for you. To download Windows 10 ISO and to create Windows 10 bootable USB flash drive, next move the Windows 10 ISO file on another drive instead of C drive. Next, double click on Windows 10 ISO file. After that, double click on this setup.executable file as you can see. Next, make sure this not right now option must be select. Then click on next. Next click on accept. Now click on change what to keep as you can see. Next make sure this keep personal files and apps must be select and don't select this second and third options. Now click on next.
Now click on install. Now be patient and leave your PC. Do nothing until the upgrade process is completed. It will take one and a half hour. So I am going to fast forward this boring part of this video. Now be patient and please do nothing. Your PC will restart several times. Alright, now it's about to be completed. Yeah done, as you can see.
now you can restart and check and i'm definitely sure that your problem is now gone and also you can see all the files and all applications that were installed that are in the same place without any kind of data loss You are done as you can see. We hope you will like. Of course, let us know your opinion. If you have any questions, then please let us know. Please like, comment, share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.